Hello and welcome to my YouTube channel Technogods. In today's video, we will discuss about the uh, Digital to Unlock Converter card in Mitsubishi PLC that is my IQR series. So let's get started. What we will be using here is that is R04 CPU with R60 DA4 that is our uh, Digital to Unlock card. So let's just start it. Uh, I have this uh, R04 CPU here and uh, I will just click on module information right click here and I will click on add new module now I will go to the analog output section then we have R60 DA4 so basically what we are doing here is same for all the other uh, cards so let's check on R60 DA4 like click OK so now we are adding module label module labels are added in the right section of element uh, the module label here now uh, what we have is just that let's double click on the uh, module information then we have this basic information related to our da 4 card that is our range switching function and that is uh, we have 0 to 4 oh, sorry 4 to 20 milli amperes 0 to 20 1 to 5 0 to 5 minus 10 to 10 and we have user defined range also like suppose if you want to uh, from 8 to 20 milliampere or from 10 to 20 milliampere or suppose you want 2 to 5 volt or 2 to 10 or 2 to 8 volts then you can uh, you know select this user range setting and you can uh, make your own range for the analog output for all the four channels now then the other we have the operation mode setting that is the conversion process and uh, we have this offset gain setting mode also for the output mode setting we have the normal output mode or we have wave output mode then we have this uh, uh, analog output holder clear setting so we have use clear here and we have enabling or disabling option is there we want to enable or disable so now we have this uh, application setting also here like scaling shift function is also there warning output rate of rate control function is also available now let's move to the refresh setting in the refresh setting we have uh, you know, device you can select the device click ok now we have uh, see this is our digital value so what the value, whatever value you will provide here will be reflected on the analog module output side uh, as, as a, you can you know check the from the voltage so let's suppose we use t10 here so what uh, the value, what we'll do is when we transfer some value to d10 it will automatically get generated uh, into some voltage that is equivalent to the uh, value the d10 so now if you talk about this is one method by which you can you know uh, uh, use this uh, digital, of digital value. Now the other is if you don't want to use this first setting and uh, let us go to the program section now. So the second method is this says, let us write um, 100. Now we have this module level right click here buffer and we can use the control channel 1 also we have this module ready command so it will do module ready and uh, we have this value so what we'll do is we'll use mov d10 and uh, let's so i will just drag and drop this value here so by doing so you can logically create your own uh, uh, like uh, uh, program to transfer the value into the module digital value so the d10 will be transferred to the digital value and we will get the output at the uh, module output side so this is all you have to do i have showed you two settings by which two methods by which you can you know use the r60 uh, da4 card so this is all in this video uh, if you like my video please like share and subscribe thank you